Yo, what's up guys, welcome back to our brand new Roblox Studio video, my name is Floppy and today guys, I'm going to be showing you how to make an E to buy a Game Pass Just before the video begins, I'd just like to say 92.2% .2 of you guys are not subscribed If you want to see more Roblox Studio videos like these, make sure to consider subscribing and turning on the notification bell so you can be the first one to be notified every single time I upload a new video so for starters, you're going to want to make sure Explore and Properties are enabled. If Explore and Properties are not enabled, you want to head up to the top bar here, click on View, and click on Explore and Properties, so that they should be somewhere on your screen. Then once you've done that, you want to click back on Home, and now you want to go and insert your part, which is going to be holding the proximity prompt. I'm just going to make it something like this, and you can rename it, change the color, you can adjust it to whatever you would like. Then inside the part, we want to click on the plus button and insert a proximity prompt. Now inside this proximity prompt you're able to adjust anything you want here. You can adjust the actual button which a player has to click to, to uh, use the proximity prompt. On default it's set to E. But all this tutorial I'm going to be changing is the whole duration to 1. But feel free to go and adjust that to however you would like. Then inside the proximity prompt you want to click the plus button and insert a script. So now that you've inserted a script into the proximity prompt, you want to go down to the description of this video, copy and paste the code that's in the description, and bring it back to Roblox Studio, remove all the previous code, and then paste in the new code. So now that we've inserted the code, you now want to go and adjust a couple things. So over here on line 2 where it says local ID equals, you want to change this ID here with your Game Pass ID. So now that you've replaced the previous Game Pass ID with your Game Pass ID, Keep in mind this will be the game pass which will be showing up on the player's screen when they click E. So once you've gone and done that, you want to go over to the top bar here, click on X next to the script. So once you've finished adjusting everything, you want to go up here and click on play to go test it out. As you guys can see, we are now in the base play and if we go and click on E, keep in mind we do have a one second hold duration. And then after we click E, the game pass will pop up for us to purchase. Now keep in mind this is a test purchase in Roblox Studio. But uh, any normal player that is inside your Roblox game will have to pay for this like normal. If you guys wanted to support me to the extra mile, super thanks and being a member on my channel is an option. Super thanks is located just below the video and to become a member, you can click the join button next to the subscribe button located below the video. If you guys are a little bit lost or you don't really know what you're doing, feel free to send me a message on Discord and I'll happily help you out. But anyway guys, I'm going to wrap up the video here. If you did enjoy, I'd appreciate if you do consider subscribing to the channel, turning on the notification bell, and also do consider liking the video. I'd really appreciate it. But anyway, have a lovely rest of your day, and I'll see you guys all in the next video. Peace.